Hello and welcome to Point of View. For the first time in a year, a Russian Soyuz crew vehicle will deliver three fresh crew members to the International Space Station on September 15, 2023. The Soyuz MS-24 mission lifted off today from Baikonur Cosmodrome, September 15, at 15.44 Universal Time Coordinated, atop a Suez 2.1A rocket, clocking the 11th flight of the Soyuz launch vehicle family for 2023. The spacecraft will be docking to ISS just over three hours later at 18.56 Universal Time Coordinated. The crew comprises Russian cosmonauts Oleg Kononenko and Nikolai Chub as well as NASA astronaut Laurel Lahara as part of Expedition 69. Cosmonauts Oleg Kononenko has flown for missions to the ISS and MS-24 is his fifth flight. Cosmonaut Nikolai Chub made his first flight into space, NASA's Laurel Lahara also made her maiden flight to space. The successful docking with the orbiting outpost will relieve the three members of Expedition 69, who stayed in orbit for a year due to a failure of the thermal control system aboard Soyuz MS-22 in December 2022. They were originally set to fly to the ISS aboard Soyuz MS-23 in February 2023, but an in-flight coolant leak aboard the docked Soyuz MS-22 back in December 2022 forced Roscosmos to make MS-23 fly to the station uncrewed. While the Soyuz rocket family has flown as many as 1,900 missions in its life since 1966, the Soyuz vehicle's current launch cadence, and Russia's overall launch cadence, is nowhere near what the Soviet program's cadence was during the Cold War. Because of Russia's invasion of Ukraine, the West imposed sanctions which forced customers like OneWeb to find other ways to launch their payloads. The European Space Agency has also stopped using the Soyuz rocket from French Guiana. Now Soyuz is mostly used for sending crew and cargo to the International Space Station along with primarily Russian civilian and military payloads. In the bright side, though, despite global geopolitical tensions being high at the moment, the United States and the Russian Federation have remained partner countries in the space station and have agreed to continue to fly each other's astronauts on their spacecraft. This is being done to ensure that both countries can continue to fly people to the station even if their own spacecraft are grounded by any mishap. Notably, Russia has announced that it will leave the International Space Station in 2028 and plans to float its own space station, but doesn't have a clear timeline for its launch. Good luck Soyuz MS-24. Wishing you a safe ride, that's a wrap. Thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next video.